Our project is called Bundles, which is uh, kind of an odd name for it, but it means bringing together diverse views about controversial issues in education. That students often are exposed only to the viewpoints of the individual faculty member with whom they're studying. I think we have a responsibility to our students to look at all sides of an issue, to present all sides, and to support the students to decide which point of view they agree with and why. The project truly tries to present dilemmas where very reasonable, well-learned, and taught individuals understand that there are different points of view, and they can articulate these different points of view. But at the end of the day of the class, they own their own point of view. I think the only way that we're going to make progress in at least the education sector, but more broadly, is to allow individuals to understand the other person's point of view, to be able to articulate it, to really uh, focus on the nuance of the argument and say, well, it's at that point right there that I don't think I agree with you, to encourage dialogue, to ex encourage exchange, so that we really can manage the dilemma. We won't solve it. My intention is not having students solve forever, but to be thoughtful in understanding and develop a deeper understanding of the issues. And with the videotape and with the supporting materials, we can stop it and we can say, now let's deconstruct the argument that Professor George or Professor Guineer just made. And that's to help the students understand the argumentative discourse. The student response was quite strong. We had, uh, I think, something like 50 or 60 students in the room. They enjoyed listening and having the time to freeze frame what was just said. And so we interspersed, and that's the bundling part of it. We, we took the videos, but then we interspersed them with discussion questions. And what did you just hear? And do you agree with that? Can you restate the argument that Professor George made or that Professor Guineer made? And again, it's, it's, that's why I think it fits so beautifully with the Hilt project, because it's truly a pedagogical approach, a new pedagogical approach enhanced by technology to, to, uh, to increase learning and learning in a new way. Dilemmas are never solved, they're managed. Problems are solved. We can put a problem, we can put a man on the moon. That's not a dilemma. But a dilemma is, should we, uh, should we have charter schools? When we look at our government, you know, should we tax the rich more or less? You could have a debate about that. And uh, so pretty much any issue that captures the interest of the press as well as the individuals is often grounded in a dilemma.